Planck is Europe's first space mission to study the cosmic microwave background, the relic radiation from the Big Bang. Ever since small temperature fluctuations were discovered in this radiation, astronomers have used them to understand the origins of the universe and the formation of the galaxies. The spacecraft is just over 4 meters high and 4 meters in diameter. Its telescope with a 1.5 meter primary mirror and its science instruments surrounded by a baffle to prevent stray light from the sun and the moon are placed on top of a service module practically identical to the one on the Herschel Space Telescope. The baffle will also radiate and cool the science payload because like Herschel, Planck's detectors have to operate at very low and stable temperatures. The spacecraft has a chain of refrigerators to cool the instruments down to a temperature range between minus 273 degrees Celsius to just one-tenth of a degree above absolute zero. Planck will be placed like Herschel in orbit around the L2 Lagrange point where it will orbit together with the Earth around our Sun. The spacecraft will not target objects but will spin on its axis, allowing its ear-like telescope to scan the whole sky. Weak microwaves will be focused on small collectors or feed horns which channel this radiation to the heart of the two supercooled instruments. Three months after arriving at the L2 point, Planck will commence routine science observations for at least 15 months, allowing two complete sky surveys. The mission could be extended depending on the remaining rare helium-3 isotope used for the lowest temperature cooler. But astronomers will start working on the Planck data as soon as they receive them. The information will require a lot of number crunching to perceive and analyze the patterns in the sky, the temperature irregularities which indicate that shortly after the Big Bang, the universe was not entirely uniform. They will be able to test cosmology on some key questions. What were the primordial constituents of the universe? How has it evolved? What is the nature of dark matter and dark energy? and the existence of gravitational waves. It will be a journey back in time and to better understand the future.